I feel like the worst mistake I made this year was buying this product. Like the worst mistake I made this year. I would have used it for hi guys welcome back to my channel so this year i started off my year on a very good note like our channel has been monetized yay so guys you'll be experiencing premium content from my page uh you all know that this is a review channel i don't just review hairs i review products that i've used and i feel like they are nice so i review them now I want to make a review about a particular product that I have seen people talk about on YouTube and TikTok. In fact, almost all the social media platform is talking about this product. Like this product is fast moving in the market. Really, it came, people rushed it, and believe me, anytime you see this product anyway, it's always sold out. So this product is called Beauty Formula Products. I don't know if this is going to sound disappointing to some of you because everybody has their way of uh, how they react to products. So me, I'm here to talk almost opposite of what I have been seeing on this uh, YouTube. In fact, not almost, just opposite of everything I've been seeing on this YouTube concerning this product. First of all, uh, before I continue, this product is not suitable for sensitive skin. If you have a sensitive skin this product will do you no good i first i saw a lot of reviews about these products and people were really really talking about it they said that the product is nice and all that so i decided to try it out i went to buy it i went to one of the um drugstore and i bought it beauty formula brightening vitamin c facial tonic i got it look as you can see i just bought it so this product when i got it i was so excited seeing reviews about it seeing what people talked about how good they praise it i saw the review of this and also the face wash but i already have a face wash which is nice on me so i decided to go for this toner because i'm yet to find a good toner that will be suitable for my skin that is affordable so i went for it i got it the first day i used it I had this burning sensation on my face like somebody applied pepper on my skin like my face all here was really hurting me that was when i now took my time to go on um youtube and other platform to check the comment section of all the reviews that i've seen and i see i always see people with sensitive skin complain of how this um this product this particular one i'm not talking about the face wash this facial toner have really, really hot their skin like some of them have this tingling feeling some of them have this hurting feeling that when they apply it it's to be as if they put pepper on their face that was exactly what i felt it was really really bad and believe me I didn't know for once that this product will do me this harm. I feel like the worst mistake I made this year was buying this product. Like the worst mistake I made this year. I would have used the product, I would use the money I used to buy this product to buy another thing that would have been beneficial to me. So I'm looking for who I'm going to give this. If you don't if you don't have a sensitive skin and you want a facial this facial toner, please come and have it because I don't know if I should mix it with water. I don't know what to do to it because it's really harsh on my face. Like when I was applying it, it was causing me redness here. Okay, I see something like brightening vitamin C facial toner. Does it brighten? Me, I don't know. Reason being that I just applied it for two days. I, I applied it the first day. It's it burnt me. It has this burning feeling. I try. I said, let me try again. The second day, maybe I have pimple that is trying to it's continued like it was burning here here was turning red that was when i said no if i continue this product it's going to hurt at least uh, as you can see i think this this place is still like that look at it still like that because of this product and i'm still trying to get back myself 
from what I got from this product. So, if you've been longing to buy this product, uh, my honest review here is this product is not really gentle on, just like they said, gentle refreshing toner to release natural tone and radiance. It's not really gentle on um, sensitive skin. There are people that are that's praising, like I see a lot of comments, that like this comment now is talking about how good this product is. Why this one now is saying how terrible it is. So people with sensitive skin have noticed that they are complaining a lot about this product. I mean, so I have sensitive skin and I'm here to give my own complaint. This product is really, really harsh on sensitive skin. Though it says a lot of things. It says that um, it contains a... Uh, vitamin b c and e to provide the goodness your skin now the, the content of this is really nice but i still maintain it's not good for a sensitive skin so if you have a sensitive skin try as much as possible to look for a mild toner i'm going to be reviewing the newest toner that i'm using right now and it's really really mild anyway when i first saw this product i thought the it's going to be yellowish inside like it's going to be having this vitamin c color but it's not too look at look at how the it's clear clear like water it's clear like water it's not it doesn't have this a uh, uh, vitamin c color but it's just the bottle that is that have the color so i bought it 2600 naira on um on a cosmetic store and I see a lot of people that send me three five and all that. Uh, but I bought my two six and I bought it last week. Last week, just last week, I bought it. So, guys, if you've tried this, please drop a comment in the comment section. Someone like someone will need to see those comments for them not to make the mistake I made and get a better toner for their sensitive skin. So you need to drop a comment if you use it. If you are, if you've tried it and it's not good for you, please drop a comment. If you've tried it and it's good for you, please drop a comment and also tell us the kind of skin you have. If you don't have a sensitive skin, please state it that is is good for you. If you if, if if it was good for you that do not have a sensitive skin, please drop it. So that people will also know that this product is working for those without a sensitive skin. And please, um, Beauty Formula Company, I want to indulge you guys to please try as much as possible to include that this product is not good for a sensitive skin. So please, so that people will also know and stay clear people with sensitive skin will stay clear from the product and maybe if we can actually produce those the, the ones that will be suitable for us that have sensitive skin so guys if at this point you've never subscribed to my channel you're wrong please hit the subscribe button turn the notification bell case i'm going to upload a new video and don't forget to like to like share and always drop a good comment on my videos for more visibility your comment means a lot to me and your comments is going to push me out for people to see me more thank you guys for watching and i hope to see you guys in my next video bye